Episode one of this playthrough was up on Frank's channel in case you missed it. Link is in the description. In one of the trailers for Pokemon Sword and Shield, they showed a clip of a trainer riding a bike through a lake. Now that sure does sound like an awful idea, now doesn't it, Sonny? Yeah, well Game Freak thinks it's apparently a really good idea. I want to test if it can be done well, in real life. you ever think about maybe Game Freak's wrong? Well, did you ever think about that we got a good, freak, good intro mode? You wanna go? What? Yeah, let's you wanna go. go. You know what? You know what? You it's do ride your bike in that lake. Yeah, yeah, and I'm gonna show you what's up. It's gonna be a really good intro moment. The people are gonna love it. All right, you know what? Actually, fair yeah. enough. Okay, cool. You, you know, so long, soldier. Good luck. King Corfish, I am recording now, and I have a proposal! Oh my god, Astromania videos, I thought that you would never ask! Yes, I will marry you! Whoa, 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 Ryan, cool it, cool it. I was just gonna ask for what? some deodorant, cause like, bro, I'm dying. <laughs> bro, 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 you said proposal, so I assumed that that meant wedding, you know, asking for your hand in marriage, I mean... No, if no. If you want some deodorant, like I have some, like literally oh. right here for you. Okay, okay, hang on. Can, can I can I come over? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure, okay. sure. Come over because, bro, as your friend, you definitely do need it. I'll keep it real. Anyways, hey everybody, King Corfish here, and welcome on back to yeah. the best Pokemon Sword and Shield Woo! Let's Play yeah! on YouTube. The best one. Woo! Nothing will ever top this. No, we it have is the peak. Of YouTube content, yeah, your one-stop shop yeah! for Sword and Shield yeah! pots, whoa, bars, yeah. If you missed the last episode, it was up on this dude's channel a couple hours ago because the schedule of this series is double daily, alternating between the two channels. So the next episode will be up on Frank's channel tomorrow, or if you're a member, it'll probably be up for you guys. Later tonight, possibly. I don't know. That's kind of up to Frank because it's in his hands. But anyways, welcome on back to the best Pokemon Sword and Shield Let's Play on YouTube. If you missed the last episode, we chose our starters. We met the champion of the Galar region, Leo. We met our rival, Hop, and we talked to Chairman Rose. It was a very, very eventful episode, so I highly recommend that you go check it out. And also, if you missed the intro moment in the last episode, I may or may not vandalize the neighborhood. Team recap! <laughs> whoa, whoa, that's one way to put it, bro. You literally, you should apply to be an electrician because you're plugging right now, bro. Oh, you already know. You already know. Anyways, you should follow me on Twitter at King. <laughs> follow me on Instagram at Ashford Videos. Anyways, without further ado, yo, I love this UI so much. We have my girl, my boy. It's actually a boy, but Haley's a girl, so... My girl, Haley, the water type Sobble, our starter named after a Mattress Master, which is our highest member tier on the channel. Shout out to you, Haley. Thank you so much. Got the ability Torrent Powers up water type moves and the Pokemon's HP is low. I actually haven't looked at any of this yet. We got Pow Powell? Yeah, we got Powell and Water Goon. Uh, and then it's Impish, which is sick. Also, Ryan, what's your Pokemon? Because I lost interest in mine. Frank, I am Score Bunny, okay? It's literally me. Hey Ryan, hey Ryan, it's it's the hey. pre it's the joke from the previous episode calling it it wants its timestamp back. Hey, hey, Frank, Frank, I'm telling you, <laughs> we're gonna be bulk recording. We may or may not need to reuse jokes sometimes, okay? <laughs> I'll keep it real. Guys, yeah, no, we're recording this like a couple hours after recording the first uh, episode. You guys know we're doing yeah. double daily, it's freaking sick. Um yep. and you know what, man, we gotta we gotta reuse assets. I, I feel that, I feel what? that. Literally. Anyways, over here we've got Carson, the score bunny. Shout out to the score bunny squad. Rocking out at level seven with the fire typing with the move set of Tackle, Growl, and Ember. Uh, Dynamax level? Oh, God, dude. I wait. shouldn't do team recaps in games that I don't understand. Wait, 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 wait. Dynamax? Uh, excuse me? Yeah, yeah, you see it in the summary right there. Dynamax level has a bunch of little Adidas symbols next to it. Wait, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, yeah, that. Oh, okay. 
I yeah, actually, yeah, I, I don't know what that means. But anyways, I, if you missed the last episode at the very end of it, Wulu escaped the city, so we have to oh. save him and stuff. Rolling around <laughs> the Wulu meadows. Got Old places bars. to roll and offenses in my way. Hope Woo. I don't run into a beep. Spoiler. Oh. Um, I, yeah, we, we've seen this part of the game. Just on that. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. I'll, I'll keep it real with everybody. We needed to grab screenshots for the thumbnail for the previous episodes. So yeah. We kinda, yeah. We already know what happens. <laughs> no, we don't know exactly what happens. We just know like a gist, which it, it's like, it makes me sad that I just spoil myself on it. But you guys know I did look at a majority of leaks. Ryan here is actually going in pretty much completely blind though. So he'll have all these fresh experiences. I don't know anything about the story. I just generally know like the Pokemon, that sort of thing. Um, but still, hey, I'm so Frank, excited. Frank, you. you know how this is the best Pokemon Sword and Shield Let's Play on YouTube? Yeah, yeah, like a phenomenal 11 out of 10, yeah. <laughs> I didn't record my gameplay for the first, like, couple minutes. <laughs> Can you just put, like... <laughs> I don't even know what you could put there. Just, are we good? Are we good now? Yeah, we're good now, but... I'll figure something out when we go to edit okay. this episode. Okay. Welcome on back to the best <laughs> Sword and Shield <laughs> Let's Play on you. We are without technical difficulties, which is totally a lie. We had so many technical difficulties with episode one. It was ridiculous. Oh, man, it was bad. Could you imagine, like, scrolling through YouTube and like, oh, wow, a Pokemon Sword and Shield co-op. You click on the video. You see a crazy intro moment of a dude riding a bike into a lake. And then it's just Pokemon <laughs> Sword. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't sit through that intro to not see Shield. All right, Ryan, Literally. Ryan, do your dialogue. Come on right, now, let's go. Come on now, pick up the pace. Huh. That Wulu, where do you think it got off to? Yo, do you hear this music? This is really dope, dude. It's a bop. It's a bop. It's a hop. It's a hop. It's a the hop. fog is really coming on thick now. <laughs> this fog is dummy thick, bro. <laughs> yeah, bro. With like four C's, a couple Q's, a silent K in there. To be honest with you. Yeah. If we don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble. Team and Rockets, this, Rocket. Us. Yeah. Oh, we Rockets got grass! Trouble. We got grass! We got grass! Ah! And our first encounter of the Nuzlocke is... What is that thing? Oh my god, Frank, it looks like you. Surprise. Happy birthday. <laughs> Yo, oh, look at man. him. Look at him. Squovet. I love him. Squovet? How do you pronounce that thing? Squovet, right? Squo that sounds... Squo Squovet. Squovet? Squovet. Squovet. I love oh him. I He's love. So he has chubby little cheeks. He's so cute. So, anyways, I don't know uh, about you, Ryan, but for this first playthrough of this game for me, I'm only going to be using uh, new Pokemon. I don't know if that's something you're putting on yourself as well. Or... I'll be honest. Okay, okay. I don't know if it's true or not because, as we said at the beginning of this video, I've avoided all of the leaks. I've avoided all spoilers. I know next to nothing about this game. Okay, the most that I know that I'm technically not supposed to know about is things that Dylan or Frank accidentally mentioned Sorry. while we were hanging out one time and I overheard it. Okay, oh, I heard, I don't know if it's true or not, that there may or may not be a Galarian Corefish in this game. Whoa, whoa, spoilers. I don't even know if it's true, I'll no, be honest. Uh, to be honest with you, I, I actually don't know either. Um, exactly, so I, isn't it a spoiler if we don't know? I, it's just a rumor, honestly, at, at this point, which I'm sure there's information out there somewhere about it because this entire game is dumped. Um, yeah, de but, definitely. But, but if there is a, uh, oh, it's a Rookity! Ah! I love, dude, I love him. I actually want him on my team. He's so cute. You'll bet. But yeah, no, so if there is a Galarian Corefish, I think that'll be my only non -Gal Galarian Pokemon. Because, like, come on, I. I I'm King Cor. I gotta have the Corefish. I think, you know? well, I, I think Galarian Pokemon count, honestly. That, that does make sense. Like, I, I think, yeah. like, I would consider Galarian forms as, like, a, like, a, a part, basically, I just want to use new Pokemon, is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, yeah, so. for sure. See, also, a thing that I don't know if it exists or not, but if it totally does, bro, you gotta use it on the team Galarian Lapras. I don't know if it exists. Here's the thing. It's just things that I've overheard whenever we're hanging out with you or Dylan. By the way, whoa, subscribe whoa, to Dylan, whoa, whoa, United whoa. Gamer. Ryan, Ryan, you, 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 you're, you're treading on some dirt there. You're Is it? You're, it you're, am I spoiling? I don't know if I am or you're, not. You're honest. treading on some spaghetti right there. That's some loose okay, noodles fine. on the ground, and you're treading fine. on it. I'm like, sorry. Bro, sorry. That, let me, that ain't sauce. Let me backpedal. I'm sorry. Let's, let's tread on some raviolis, and that way it's a little bit better, all right? Exactly. Exactly. No, that ain't sauce. Better that, now. Better, better now. now. I'll be saying. Yo, dude, that's been stuck in my head all day. It's ridiculous. Yeah, actually, same, though. To be fair, we've been hanging out literally all day today. We haven't really left each other's sides all morning, so. 
Uh, yeah, no, in case you guys don't know, we're both running off an hour of sleep uh, right now. And I actually, I felt more tired in the previous episode. Like, I'm yeah. actually waking up now, which is nice. So, basically, what ended up happening was we posted that first episode, and almost immediately, there was so much support and positivity, and just such positive feedback and reception from you guys on it. Thank you so much. Yeah, you guys uh, are, that. It, you guys are phenomenal. It just hyped this up to record episode two now i'm i'm really excited about this project thank you so much for uh enjoying the first episode and if you have missed it it's up on frank's channel make sure you're subscribed because if you're not you'll miss out on half the project come on trouble <laughs> bro this willow is dead i'm telling you right now this willow is gone he's like he actually has been sheared dude he's du he's just he's dusted why do you have to put it into the universe, dude? I don't want Wulu to be dead. He's too cute. Wulu like, Wu lost his life. Let's just be. Let's just tell it how it is. Let's just tell it how it is, man. He's gone. <laughs> He's absolutely deceased. Oh my. <laughs> He's gone, bro. I mean, I hate to be that guy, but I'm just. I'm just telling the truth. Yo, uh, you know, as if you're honest, watching at this point of the episode, I want you to comment down below. Wulu Wu lost his life. Okay, <laughs> this, that's just gonna be the comment of the day right there. All right. Yeah. That's gold. <laughs> All right, I'm going to wait for you to catch up because you're kind of falling behind. Yeah, no, I'm slightly behind you. Come on, Ryan the Wooloo might be in real trouble. Yeah, Frank just thinks he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, the Wooloo is Frank. beyond saving. Bro, oh, my bro. God. Frank, seriously, he has no faith in this Wooloo. <laughs> no, because <laughs> honestly, he hear me out, right? First of all, he was stupid enough to ram the fence after Hop specifically told him not to multiple yeah. times. Literally, he said, no, he said, no, still doing the fence. And he still yep. did it. And then he did it again after he had mm -hmm. left. Ridiculous, right? Also, yep. you got to understand when you're rolling at the velocity that a Wooloo is rolling at, you lose control at a very rapid rate. So when you start yes. spinning like, you know, especially with how like slopey this region is, it's very, very easy to imagine how this Wulu could lose control very, very quickly. And also yes. considering the lack of visibility in this forest, like, can you imagine like as you're spinning already, you can't see as is, but you tack that on with the added layer of fog and oh mm -hmm. my God, bro, this Wulu is gone. This Wulu is exactly. actually deceased. Now, here's the thing. I don't know a lot about the biology of sheep. I don't know how strong their vision is. For all we know, maybe that their sense of vision is stronger in the fog. I don't know. But basically, what I'm getting out of this weird little conversation that me and are having right now is that Wulu deserved to die. This is mad. <laughs> I can't even hold my hand in front of my face. I think I know why this place is off limits. <laughs> they say there's a Wulu hunter in these parts. <laughs> Oh snap. oh snap! Oh snap! Oh snap! Oh crackle pop! Oh snap! Oh crackle uh -huh. pop! Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh Jesus! I didn't know this game came with jump scares. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! This is Five Nights at Freddy's. If it were Pokey, uh, that didn't make well, any sense. I mean, well, I mean, it's a wolf. I mean, that's close to the animatronics in Five Nights at Freddy's. I, well, I wouldn't put it past them. So, okay, Ryan, I, I know I've already told you this, but I'm gonna uh, say it for the viewers. This, yeah, obviously, surprise, legendary, cool, right? Um, whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Do our faces on the thumbnail represent our actual reactions? I don't know. Anyways, though, um, the cool thing about this that these clearly aren't the forms that are found on the box. Um, I don't know mm -hmm. exactly how the forms work with these legendaries, but it's cool because it's like, it's, a, it's different. It's yeah. cool. I don't We're know. seeing like a little bit of a more vulnerable version of these legendaries, basically a little bit more in their natural wild habitat. A Dude, little, a I'm little looking, more, what? I'm looking at this dialogue right now and I'm imagining Hop saying, what in the United? <laughs> what in the United? Beep. No, honestly though, this is their naked form. This is their ready to mate form. He's looking at us with those with those sexy eyes. Anyways, and Frank, what? Now we're demonetized. Thank you, YouTube. <laughs> Lorad grilled, <laughs> grilled spaghetti. Yo, I love him. I love him. Oh my god. Oh my god. He has the same name as the rival from Johto. Question mark. Question mark. Question mark. Well, is is Zaza, is is Zaza Mental legendary box art the same as the rival from Soul Silver? But that's just but a hey, theory. That's just a theory. <laughs> yeah, I love I Yo. love this. Can we talk about this music is a bop? Yo. You hear that bass line? That's actually really, really funky. I like it. I like it. Okay, son. Okay, let's go fight uh water gun. Yo, okay. I, I here's the thing. They're blocking out his level. He, they're blocking out his name. Whoa. I have no clue what this could possibly be. The move had no effect. Mysterious Pokemon's gaze is fixed on you. What? The move had no effect on it. Nunny, oh his power level. 
Is is Hop a poker tuber? Cause he's commentating right now, bro. Bro, literally. So wait, we can't we can't hit him? He's a ghost. Apparently. apparently. No, 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 you you gotta go for a physical? Nope, never mind. The move has no effect. What did he just go oh, for? Bro. Haze? Follow at United Haze on Twitter. Yo, maybe. Shout out to Dylan, I love him. Astro, I can't see anything. You okay? Do we run? Oh my god. I don't know. Dude, I'm just waiting for the Wulu to like fall from the sky and just yeet the Zanazenta and be like. And that's why I broke the fence. This wolf was going to eat the city. <laughs> he just kills it. That's just it. Yeah. Yeah, and I don't know what move to go for. I have a feeling that we're supposed to lose right here. Oh, we already lost the Nuzlocke. Yeah, wow. Big sad, big sad. Yo, this is actually really, really cool. I know that... This kind of stuff has happened in ROM hacks before, where like they throw you into battles that you're supposed to lose, specifically Pokemon Snakewood, they have something like that, but they've never done that in a main series Pokemon game. This is so no. sick. I love it. No, no, they did. Really? When? When have uh, they ever done something like this? Ultra Necrozma. That's why I don't know. You're, <laughs> no, you're, I, I mean, I don't know if you're technically supposed to lose, but it, it's, it's basically like, yeah, you're going to die. Oh my God, he killed us. Plot just, we just were kidding. dead the whole time. But hey, that's just, just a, a theory. A uh, game. Anyways. Um, All right. Voice Leon. Hop. Uh, no. Yeehaw. Uh, hop. Asteroid. Yeehaw. Was that a was that no, a doggo? <laughs> that looked like Boomy. Was that a Boomy that I just saw? Shout to Boomy. Why? Uh, oh, that's you. Why? <laughs> why? <laughs> He's Waluigi. <laughs> He's actually Waluigi. <laughs> why? Lee, how what? did you manage to find your way here? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, uh, your pants with direction. That's not a saying, Game Freak. No, I, be no, that I bet that's a saying in the UK. No. Your I pants. Like we should. Everybody, could you all tweet to Game Boy Luke and ask if that's a slang term in the United Kingdom, please? Is that a your thing? Your pants with directions. You are pants. That actually, it, it kind of makes sense. Like, no, I get what they're going for. I've just never heard it before. I feel like that's so forced. Like, Game Freak. Stop. Yeah, I'm going to be like, yo, you're so shirt with directions, bro. You're so sock with those directions, man. Bro, Frank, you're really boxer in it with those directions right now. Keep uh, it real. Thanks, bro. I cleaned them yesterday. Oh, I'm proud of you. Thanks, man. You saw me do laundry. Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah. I'm very proud of you for that. We lived together in case you guys didn't know that. Surprise. He walked in my face cam a couple minutes ago. I feel like you probably knew that. Whatever. Voice Leon, go. Oh, I thought you didn't finish hot. Okay. Oh, that's, that's nice to hear from my little brother who had me worried sick. I took three Tylenol and almost threw up. I waited <laughs> ages for you two, and you never showed. Kind of like my puke when I ate that Tylenol. <laughs> uh, I don't know. <laughs> of course, I came looking for the both of you like sheep in a herd. Wait, where's the Wooloo? We were trying to rescue the Wooloo. I can't wait for Leon to be like, and the wolf thing <laughs> ate the Wooloo. <laughs> Oh, you didn't see that Wulu corpse hanging from? He's like, oh, that's what that has that dead Watt thing was. <laughs> no, it's like the Charge, like the camera pans over the Charge are just holding the dead oh! Wulu. He's like, are you looking for this? <laughs> oh, look at him! They're best friends. The, li the little chap is just fine. I love him. The all you had fame about time I found you here. You know this place is out of bounds. The courage to come in here all the same, and I can't understand why, why you did it. You did good, Hop. You broke the rules, and I encourage that. Anyways. What is he doing with his hand? It's a little suggestive. I don't know how I feel about that, bro. I, th I think he wants the. I think he wants the Wulu. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> and at least the Wulu's all right. Yeah, Rystroid. Trying to combine our names here so that way it makes sense. I thought we'd had it when that weird fog started rolling into that mad Pokemon attack, but at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attack by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about? Hot? <laughs> how dare you speak in that disrespectful tone? <laughs> Bro, look at Leon's face. He is pissed right now, bro. He's gone. <laughs> it seemed loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen, and it just had this sort of presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really, they seemed to pass right through it. -na 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 -na. He's a Pokemon. He's a Phantom. <laughs> Your moves pass right through it, so the fiercest Pokemon, they say, live in the slumbering world. Are they actually illusions or something? Get strong enough. Maybe oh. the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth. That would act, that'd actually be kind of cool. Maybe it wasn't actually legendary. Maybe it was just an illusion. Yeah, like a hallucination or something. Yeah. That'd be really sick. Which, in like a weird little enchanted fog kind of forest like this, I could see that being a thing. Yeah, it makes sense. Anyways. Yeah, we did get an earful <laughs> oh, from Lee. 
Oh, what an experience. What an make experience. A oh, sorry, sorry. My bad, my bad. Oh, yeah, no, <laughs> you're stealing my character, bro. What the heck? No, I, I'm what sorry. I, I was the understudy. My bad. Okay, I don't blame you there, but I'm telling you, I'm not sick. I was actually coughing up a storm right before this recording session, but I'm not sick. <laughs> All yeah. right. This will make a pretty fine first page of the tale of my legend. And I got my one string of dialogue. That was worth it. <laughs> <laughs> we literally, we halted everything for that. We were like, all right, Hobbs, say something good. Come on. Come on, bro. Oh, man. Don't forget to tell your mom we're off to Wedgehurst now. I guess we're off to Wedgehurst now. <laughs> Thanks, Hop. <laughs> oh, man. She'll go spare if you leave without a word. Even worse than Lee just did. I don't think that's a saying either, Game Freak. You're really forcing some slang. I'll be honest with you. No, I, I honestly, I do think, like, there's no way they're just making up slang, you know? No, no, I really think that, the, have you ever, in your 18 years of living, heard someone say, your pants with directions? Well, Ryan, I don't live in the UK. That is actually understandable. All right, mom, I'm leaving. <laughs> that's mom. like, that's like, Ryan, that's like saying, that's like seeing a character speak Spanish in a video game and being like, wait, I've, I've never, I've never heard that before, so therefore, therefore, no. It's not true. Yeah. <laughs> No. <laughs> oh, wow. Yo, is Sobble Waluigi? <laughs> Yo, honestly? Anyways. But hey, that's just a thing. I've said that like four times in this episode so far. Yo, I, I just the best Pokemon Sword and Shield let's play on YouTube. <laughs> Heck yeah. I just want to give a quick shout out to Vinny and Dylan. They're doing their own uh, co-op project. Definitely check it out. Um, mm -hmm. By the way, United Gamer, original 51. You already know what's up. So I was actually, I was watching their part and mm -hmm. um, they called the mom thick. And I would just like to commemorate that. Did Vinny call the mom thick or yeah. did Dylan call the mom thick? No, no, Vinny didn't. I, I could not agree more. Also, okay. I have a question for you. Because here's the thing. Dylan is a married man. I don't think that he'd be hitting on our mom. <laughs> they also they also compared her to Lex. So <laughs> not even joking. That's actually what they said. Reference, reference. Yeah. Anyways, Ryan, I have a pretty serious question. I'm scared of what the serious question is. You just dropped a whole lot of knowledge on no, me that no, I wasn't it, aware of. It's, un but, it's unrelated. What, what's your question? What's can, your we question? Do, can we do a jump cut? Sure. Because my, my audio interface is messed up. Okay, sure. Okay. Blop! Blop! Welcome back. Sorry for the technical difficulties, but we are here. It is time. Our mom is thick as hell, but it's all right. We out here. We doing the good oh. iron thing. Starting Gosh. off. Gosh. Gosh, what? But you just had to bring up our mom being thick as heck, bro. I'm actually offended. I'm just bring, I'm, Are you saying she's not? Well, Frank, I would not judge my mother like that. Okay, like, well, I know she's we live not, in Georgia. Brian, I know we're pretty far down south. She's but I was a, like, come on, bro. Brian, Brian, she's a fictional character with pink flower boots. I can call her thick. Anyways, well, now <laughs> is she a fictional character or a fictional character? <laughs> Welcome back to the best Pokemon Sword and Shield. Let's play on YouTube. All right, Frank, say whatever you're gonna say. Well, now isn't Sable just a thick heart? Ah, uh, yes, I heard the news from <laughs> young Leon. <laughs> I'm glad someone bothered to tell me, as I was so thick, I didn't even notice. Off to Wedgeworth, aren't you? I hope my thickness doesn't get in the way of your travels. <laughs> oh my god, why are you saying thick where, so many where, times? Where, where are your eyes drifting? Oh wait, just that's just my thick, my thickness. Oh my god, Frank, this is our mother! Here we are, a bit of pocket money for your journey. It came out of my thick account. <laughs> My okay, okay, that one was forced. That one was bad, no, bro. No, I have a better one. I have a better one. <laughs> okay, sure. My, my body ain't the only thing that's thick. My bank account is as well. Here is some cash. I mean, that's slightly better, but what? No. no. <laughs> Actually, holy crap, our mom is thick. Bro, that's what I'm saying. Yo, Vinny, Yo, like, Vinny sparked this revolution. Yo, get some thick mums up in the chat. You already know what's up. <laughs> or up in the comments. Yo, if you're watching at this point of the episode, comment down below, thick mum. Thick like, mum. Okay, actually, look at her. Like, question of the day. Would you smash? Which thigh is your favorite? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'll be honest. I'm actually liking the right thigh. It's a little bit thicker. Like, no, like, we're going to look at this real quick. Like, right there. Look at that. That's nice and thick. It's like a big meaty meatloaf, to be honest with you, bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's not, let's not compare her to a meatloaf. Come on now. <laughs> Come on now. She's thick, but she ain't, she ain't a meatloaf thick. Let's be real. I mean, no. Okay, okay. You're saying that she's less thick than a meatloaf? Like, come on, bro. Like, she's nice, juicy, really, really meaty. Uh, Dorothy, I, I'm into it. <laughs> Ryan, 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 this is our mother. What are you doing? You are, oh, you oh, are. how the turns have tabled, haven't they, bro? <laughs> you are, bro, you are something else right now. That's our mom, dude. What are you doing? <laughs> 
What are you doing? Here bro? we go. This is quite the big step, you know, my first step between the something something becoming the champion. Guess I'll probably train up Grookey a bit by having a battle in the Pokemon in the tall grass. You should get yourself to the building with the purple roof and the great red and white ball. Mark out on front. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Nice. It's the Pokemon Thick Lab. It's the thickest Pokemon lab in the game. Oh, Pokemon! There's a Pokemon! It's a squirrel! Oh, oh my him. god. Yo, yo, do you see this? The Wulu are phasing in and out of existence right now, bro. Yo, he yo, he learned from the from the dog, dude. He learned how to phase. Yo, that's why Wulu went into the forest, so then that way he could be young oh! uh, a young Padawan to the wolf. What is going on Ryan! on your side of the screen? Oh my god, what, Ryan, what's happening? What's happening? Okay, so excuse me, I didn't know. That um okay, okay here, here, here's my mindset. Oh we have Pokemon. Okay okay shoot. So Frank Frank your mind is going a mile a minute right now. No, what I, is happening? I know. Okay so in the forest when we found this squirrel, I was actually gonna try and catch it, but we didn't have balls at the time. I don't know when we got balls, but now we have them, so I'm totally catching the squirrel. Yeah no okay. Can I get the rickety? So sure. like we both have like a Route One Mon. I feel like that'd be cute. Yeah sure. I, honestly like I I haven't really decided who I want to use. I'm gonna be just kind of going with the flow but it would be cool yeah. if we had slightly different teams oh well of course we gotta have slightly different teams bro this is a co-op we're trying to like really compare and contrast a lot of differences between the games and everything kind of have our own like experience our own playthrough with it which also uh and i curse him you gotta crit <laughs> get, get, get wrecked bro get skeeted you just got you just got deleted bro god oh, man what, what's that pokemon what's that pokemon called rookity Yo, I just got Rookie deleted, bro. <laughs> okay, that was good. I gotta, I gotta give you some claps for that one. I gotta give you a little bit of a round of applause. I just learned Quickle Tick. Quickle Tick. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> yeah, boy. Oh my goodness. And I just found a potion. Whoa. It's crazy. I can't believe that there are potions in the overworld in this game. That's so. Nuts. I don't know if you've noticed yet, but this is the first Pokemon game where you can catch Pokemon before a catching tutorial. Oh, <gasps> that's not true. No, it is. That's not true. Kanto. No, because you, you don't get balls until... Frank? Wait. Hoenn! Bro, bro, Hoenn, the catching tutorial isn't even until Petalburg City. Remember, that's when Wally catches the routes. You can totally catch Pokemon before then. Oh, okay, never mind. Frank, you were so <laughs> confident with that, bro. I was like, okay, because I, I didn't really think about it. I just heard it somewhere. So I was like, Frank. Or maybe Frank. maybe that wasn't the fact. Maybe it's just that the catching tutorial is skippable or something. I don't know. Frank, Frank, you were so confident. I know. That with was bad. <laughs> that was bad. All right, mm. I'm going to go ahead and name this school vet after a member on the channel. Big shout out to you guys. If you guys want a chance to be named after Pokemon, become a member today on either of our channels. You guys are sick. Mm. Um, There's a join button at the top of the description. It would mean a lot if you guys clicked it. It really does go such a long way to support what we love to do each and every day. Each and every day. Yeah, we. All right, oh, so my goodness. when it comes to how I choose members, I'm going to be choosing it uh, based on your your username because I want to find like the best username to fit the Pokemon, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. um, so oh, like, for sure. So like my boy Blinky, who's been a Couch Crew member uh, for 13 <laughs> days, big shout out to you, man. Thank you so much. I'm going to go ahead and name this thing Blinky because I think Blinky Yo. really works. You know, like a really fun thing about Blinky, by the way, which also, if you want to like, you know, get to know us better and everything show up to a lot of the live streams if you comment quite a bit and like we recognize you as a recurring viewer then you can actually like be so much more involved in the community uh, but anyways that was a little bit of a sidetrack so blinky you know he has four accounts wait for real yeah there is blinky bonnie clyde oh god i can't remember all four of them all the top of my head but they're all named after the ghosts in pac-man Oh, yeah. that's actually so cute. Yeah, no, and he becomes members on all of our channels on all four accounts. It's really, really funny. It's oh. cute. I love it. What a, what a, what a legend, dude! Shout out to my man. He is a legend on Dylan's channel. Oh, nice. That's the name of his fifty dollar too. <laughs> oh my all right, so, so anyways, wanna... I made it to the research lab right now. If you want to head over here. Oh shoot! Well, I kind of want to. Okay. <laughs> kind of want to what, Frank? I'll just, I'll just. Okay, I'll switch train for. Whoa. Dude, this UI is sick. Okay, dude, dude, could you, okay. Remember Sun and Moon and how the, the UI was absolute garbage? Yeah. This no. is like such a step up, dude. It's no. ridiculous. Dude, I loved the Sun and Moon UI. The scribbles, I thought were so aesthetic. I thought that was really, really dope. It was disgusting. You're disgusting. I am disgusting. <gasps> There's a fox! It's a yeah, fox! Yeah, no, I already ran into the fox. I thought about 
wanting to catch it because I really love his design, but I figured he's already a fire type. I already have one. I actually, I don't know what type he is. You know, I'm I honestly... Like fire. He looks like a fire. Do you know what I think I'm going to do? I, I've been kind of questioning as to, like, how I'm going to go about this game, right? Because, like, obviously I want to... You know, I want a balanced team and I want to like have a set team, but I also want to use as many Pokemon as possible. Yeah, um, no, I feel that I have absolutely no clue what Pokemon I want to use. Like I have a vague idea, but that's all that it is. I don't know when I'm going to be able to catch those Mons or where, you know, maybe they're even post game Mons. That's the weird thing about playing a new Pokemon game. Yeah, you know, honestly, what I think I'm going to do right is I'm just going to I'm going to go out of my way to catch a lot of these Pokemon. Um, mm -hmm. And then as I catch more, I'll just kind of like narrow down exactly who I want to use. That's so interesting. Honestly, you know what I'm going to do? Comment down below what Pokemon I should use on my team. <laughs> now, that's actually something. I love reading the comments on every single episode of these videos. Mine yeah. and yours channels. That, that's something. Uh, comments is just one of my favorite things about YouTube in general. The fact that you can just interact with the content creator like in real time is just, it's sick. Yeah. Social media platforms tend to do that. Yeah. Well, not all of them. Not Tinder. <laughs> yeah, well, is Tinder a social media platform? Is that a... Yo, question of the day, is Tinder a social media platform? <laughs> I mean, I, I guess by definition, yeah, but it's not... I, I guess so. I don't know. I don't know. I want to hear your, your thoughts on that down in the comments. I don't know why, but Tinder just seems to come up in a lot of me and Frank's commentary conversations. You know, I haven't <laughs> used Tinder since August. I've actually, I haven't I... used Tinder since last month either, actually. For real? Yeah. Okay, son. Um, also, by the way, uh, I got a Nicket. Is his name? Yeah. No, I don't know if you see my timestamps or not, uh, but <laughs> I put 30 minutes. Frank got the squirrel thing. 32 <laughs> minutes. Frank got the fox thing. I don't know these mom's names, so I'm just kind of typing away. Yeah, I feel that. All right, we're going to go ahead and name uh, this thing Morgan after Morgan Woo. LeDrew. Thank you so much for being a member. I really appreciate it. And the cool thing about catching all these new mons is that it opens up a lot of possibility for nicknames for members. Yeah, no, cool. I... Honestly, I want to take a page out of your book. I want to nickname encounters after as many members as possible. So if you want to be nicknamed after any encounter in this playthrough or any other playthrough, become a member. It means a lot. Yo, yo, I just picked up a Pokemon and it gave me two Paralyzed Seals and one... Frank, wow. I did that like in 1976. You you realize how far behind that you are right now. Okay, well, I ain't a, I ain't a Pokemon Shield speedrunner. Charizard! Ah! What's up, Charizard? <laughs> Rawr. I love him. <laughs> Rawr. Rawr. Okay, so Get where are we going? Get to the freaking research lab, I'm bro! working on it! Oh, God. a likely story! Don't rush me in my Pokemon experience! That Charizard just Well done, on. you reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon research lab. Yeah, after 26 years, Leon! <laughs> Sorry, Leon. <laughs> you did a far side <laughs> better than I did my first time. I took 30 years. I'm almost <laughs> with direct. Yo, he's literally... Bro... It's crazy. Bro, you're literally Leon, and I'm literally Hop. All right, I'm yeah. good at races. Apparently, I'm Speedy McSpoomzooms fast. Yeah, yeah, you're Kachowin, Kachowin up the, the Galarp. See how your rose already grow all things that Pokemon. <laughs> I know I'm. You sure really tried there, bro. That was a <laughs> solid attempt. You, like, like I think I was watching your face cam while you were trying to say that. Your your brain just shut down. You're like, yeah, yeah. you're really Kachow, Kachig, the, the Galarp. Yeah, no, I, I gave up. See how the world's already grown? <laughs> woo woo! Into the lab we go! Woo! We're on the road to the Pokemon lab! I got ooh, a lab ooh, ooh. in my Pokemon. Uh -huh. Yo, this I, is sick. It is sick. I've got to give I it to love Professor. The interior design. Likely story. Professor Mangolia, everything in here looks fascinating. <laughs> I like the I interior what? design. Dude, do you know what's crazy? What's crazy? Okay, I. I, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not one to like believe in like, like voot. His paws, his paws. Oh, it's cute. I'm not one Frank, to, Frank, he's going to do it again. Watch. <laughs> I'm not one to believe in voodoo magic, right? Uh huh. But literally you, you mentioned the interior design. Leon mentioned the interior design. I mentioned how I was lost. Leon mentioned how we were lost. That's yeah, actually, I like a feeling. There's, there's a coincidence, man. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a spaghetti. I feel like Game Freak knew we were going to play these games. <laughs> Maybe. Yo, yo, yo. This is actually my favorite character. I love her. Can I voice her? How do you know it's her? I don't know her name. For all I know, this could be the legendary wolf. <laughs> <laughs> what is it today, Leon? 
<laughs> nah. Looking for info on another never before seen super strong Pokemon? I wish you'd stop with. No, hang on. We gotta give her a Starbuck voice. Oh my god! Actually, I wish you'd stop with these outlandish requests. The Starbucks voice fits really well for Magnolia. Holy crap. That's not her. That's not Magnolia. Really? No, yeah. The Magnolia is the old professor. She's like the assistant or something. I, I forgot her name. I don't know what her name is. I, I'm, I'm gonna call I'm gonna call her Flare You Girl. <laughs> okay. Because her hair's orange. Good to see you too, Yamper. Yamper here is a real champer when it comes to helping you find your way around. He just completely changed back in the day when I got lost on the road. He yamped my style, bro. And yeah, it's his trainer, so flary hair girl. What did you say? I don't even remember, I'll be honest. Let's just call her It's Lit Fam. <laughs> <laughs> what can I say about it? It's Lit Fam? Well, I like the way she cooks. <laughs> wow, okay. She looks pretty can gobble down in a flash. Can we okay? Can we backpedal real quick? Yamper is a real champer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, I don't know how the hell, but you managed to make me laugh like in every episode. You're just a dumb little boy. Th thanks. Maybe. Okay, sorry. Uh, dumb big strong man. Thanks. It was. <laughs> oh my god! Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? I got beat because like it's lit fam, but like <laughs> it wasn't just Yamper helping you out. I did too. Yo, so if you're watching yo, this point of the episode, yo, comment down below. She is so pain. pretty! Ah! Frank? Frank, okay, first our mum, and now it's lit fam. Is anything sacred to you? No, is no, no. Okay. woman uh, wholesome? It, Did you show up to the Galar region to hit on girls? Okay, if our mum is thick, she's hot. It's lit fam. I mean, come on. It, it like, seriously, like, look at her. I love the hearts in her hair. It's cute. Anyways. Anyway, nice to meet you. Name's Sonia. I'm the professor's assistant. No, no, her name is It's Lit Fam. It's Lit Fam. <laughs> this is Ryan in Asteroid. He's a new Pokemon <laughs> trainer. Set him on the right path, would you? <laughs> they have a crush on you. <laughs> <laughs> I could tell they're hard. <laughs> I sense it with my unbeatable championness. <laughs> uh, who does he think I am? I'm always hard. <laughs> He's everybody's always hard. God, he's always got his head in the clouds. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Ah, oh, it's lit, fam. <laughs> oh, looks like you got a Rotom phone. Hey there, Rotom. Dude, Rotom is actually in that phone. That's sick. Dude, that's so cool. I bet Luke absolutely loves this. Shout out to Game Boy Luke. I love how they're integrating Rotom into all these things. It's actually really cool. You know, it's really, you know what's really cool is the fact that they're integrating a phone into Pokemon. Like, I know that's not like an unheard of thing. They have it in like Gold and Silver, like the Pokenav and stuff like that. But I don't know, that thing literally looks like an iPhone. You know what I mean? Like, it's cool know. that it's it's cool that it's modernized, you know? Yeah, that that's my point. Thank you, Frank. You're picking up on what I'm putting down. Like, comparing this to like Pokemon Red and Blue, it's so cool how like technology is. Yeah. Science is amazing. Science is amazing. <laughs> Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? They got a map and a navigation tool. Wow. That said, Leon still gets lost, so. Yeah, don't oh, use sorry. Apple Maps. It's terrible. It's absolutely garbage. So tell me, do you know a lot about Pokemon? <laughs> you Not bet really. I do. <gasps> Yo, bet! <laughs> is that what it said? It said you bet, but let's oh. just remove a you. I'm illiterate. I'm from Georgia. Yo, bet! Close enough. Well said. In that case, oh, I'll make it so you can use the... Girl. Ryan, you trying to steal my woman? Yeah, I'll give you her mom. <laughs> okay, all right, Ryan. All right, Ryan. No, no, no. You take my mom. I'll take her. Cool? That way it's not incest. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I'll let you have it, lit fam. Okay. But I want the next hot girl. Okay, fair. Fair enough. Awesome. Awesome. In that case, I'll make it so you can use the Rotom Dex on your Rotom phone. You obtained yeah. the Pokedex. Yeah. Just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my grand. Could you like I want the grand. <laughs> she lives in the house down a long route, too. Next hot girl. Dibs right. to route two. <laughs> I want the grand. I want the grand. Hey, sir, Come hey, on, sir, I need me a gift. Go. All right. Hey, there, got... trainer. Sorry to stop you, but that grand is mine. <laughs> I, I scooped up the grand. <laughs> you were a grand too late. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, bro. I love talking to trainers giving them useful stuff like protection for Gran. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> oh my god. It's only episode two. I hope you guys realize our commentary is just gonna get more and more screwed up as this series goes along. I love this. This whole adventure just about like the protagonist being horny as frick. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, bro. And we are the protagonists. It's, it's, it's like personification, okay? Yeah. We have put ourselves into these characters. Oh, no. The main protagonist has been possessed by an evil, horny spirit. 
<laughs> what, what, what will we do? <laughs> Better find Gran. <laughs> oh my god. Please, please read the dialogue. <laughs> Change the oh, subject. I hit a couple times. I think he was just explaining what potions do, and I already know that. This ain't my first Rodeo. This ain't my first Pokemon game. Hey, it's definitely my first Pokemon game where I hit on every character, but you know what? There's new experiences for everything. So do you want to wrap it up oh. here? I was just about to ask that. Yeah. Yo, okay. say some final words, bro. Heck yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, hit the like button down below. Comment and subscribe if you guys did enjoy. Um, we love you guys. Thank you guys so much for your support as always. Episode three will be up tomorrow on my channel. We're doing double daily. So two episodes a day. Um, both our channels. Subscribe to both of us. You already know what's up. And uh, we'll yep. see you guys tomorrow. Yeah, thank you all so much for everything. Hope to see you for episode three tomorrow. If you want to check out some of our other content that we do, because me and Frank do a lot of work here on YouTube, uh, we have an end card at the end of this video. If you want to check out our Pokemon 4-Way Versus with United Gamer and Game Boy Luke, it's a really, really fun and ambitious project if you're curious. But with all that being said, thank you for everything. Catch you all next episode tomorrow. Love you all. Peace, peace. Oh, peace! <laughs> <laughs> Brian, stop pissing my mailbox! What Dylan, we, we need an idea for the intro moment! God, that gosh darn Dylan ruining our fun! Dynamax is actually a new way to power up your Pokemon in these games. Don't worry, I've got an idea. <laughs>